Good afternoon from your National Weather Service forecast office in Norman. This is a update on later this afternoon and tonight's forecasted severe weather potential. Kind of quite a lot going on, so we'll try to get started here. We are looking for strong to severe thunderstorms expected late this afternoon, early this evening, and it's going to last through early Monday morning. We'll show you the timing here in just a few minutes, but the time frame is going to be 5 to 8 o'clock or so in the southwest portions of Oklahoma and, and northwestern uh, counties of North Texas. And then overnight in the I-35 corridor and then uh, moving through well, most, of the, most of the metro areas between about 9 o'clock and midnight and then exiting into eastern Oklahoma after midnight. There is a threat for tornadoes today, but uh, we are really looking for uh, widespread wind damage as the main hazard. Uh, large hail is also expected early in the evening. As time goes along though, this is going to be a widespread wind event and uh, the winds are definitely going to be felt once the uh, storms move through. Even after the storms go through, uh, late tonight, early tomorrow morning, we are still going to be, have some gusty west to southwest winds. Tomorrow morning is going to be more typical of Oklahoma and Texas. Uh, type winds, but as the thunderstorms move through, 80 mile per hour winds are actually very possible for tonight for a fairly widespread area. So once again, main focus for tonight is damaging wind, and that's going to be late in the evening or overnight. Please do not fall for the it's just a severe thunderstorm warning, uh, because this is expected to be a high-end event uh, even if there are no tornadoes whatsoever. So it's the wind that's going to be the main thing as they come through, and that's going to be the thing we're really going to be most worried about tonight. Wireless emergency alerts will be triggered if we issue a severe thunderstorm warning with 80 mile per hour wind gusts. So please keep that in mind. So your phone may go off overnight, and that's a good thing if that thing does go off. Uh, because of a warning that we issue, that means it's going to be on the higher end of things, and it's definitely not just a severe thunderstorm warning. So please have a way to receive and act upon those warnings overnight. If you are in a, in a uh, mobile home, um, those are not going to be the safest place tonight with the line of thunderstorms. So if you do live in a mobile home, please have an early plan and uh, make sure you get to safety uh, well in advance of the thunderstorms. So as far as timing, most of the area is under severe risk. Now, don't worry too much about exactly what color you're in. Uh, basically, there is a, a risk for severe weather uh, tonight. The main time frame for tornadoes is going to be about 5 o'clock to 8 p.m., but really 8 p.m. through about 2 o'clock in the morning. As the storms line out, that's when we're really going to be focused on. So the primary risk is damaging straight-line winds, possibility of power outages and things like that. So make sure you have everything charged that you would like to have charged and make sure you have a way to get warnings and make sure that you uh, can act upon those when the time has come. The tornado risk is pretty much everywhere. It is the highest into the Clinton, Lawton, Altus area and even on the western side of the metro areas. But once again, even if we do have tornadoes, the main risk is going to be straight line winds, and those are going to be in the 70 to 80 mile per hour range, possibly even higher than that. So this is definitely not just your, your typical day. So the only other thing we'd like to point out is tonight, the storm motion is going to be extremely fast. We may start out with normal 40 to 50 mile per hour uh, thunderstorm motions to the north and northeast. Eventually, it's going to go from west to east, probably closer to about 60 to 65 miles per hour. So once those warnings are issued, you must act quickly. So make sure you have a plan and make sure you've thought about everything that you want to think about tonight because we really want you to follow the weather this evening and overnight tonight and stay very safe. So once again, uh, please don't fall for the, uh, you know, it's only a, a thunderstorm morning. Uh, that is not the thing that we want you to take away from today. The other thing is don't get fooled by the cool temperatures early in the afternoon. Uh, this is going to be a event that's not like our typical Maytime events. Uh, in May, you kind of depend on the sun. Uh, in this event, 
It's not going to matter because the upper level storm system is moving through New Mexico and West Texas now and will be on top of us by uh, about 9 to midnight tonight. So make sure you've got a plan, keep yourself safe, and uh, continue to follow the National Weather Service forecast office here in Norman and uh, keep yourself safe later on today.